You know, I'm, you, you can't really tell how bad the wind is because I'm kind of tucking away from it. But every once in a while, I get in the area, I poke a fish like this, I hit spot lock, doom, 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 fan cast around it. And a lot of times I'll get one or two more, just boom, boom, boom. That spot lock is one of the most amazing tools that ever came on the scene. Well, when it comes to quality, it's been an amazing day overall. Holy crap, these big, big brown bass are everywhere. Ah, she ain't, that ain't as big as I thought, but she is tougher than nails, like they all are. I'm getting a little bit windy. We got a little, we're in a little bit of wind, and you know what? It's not an easy deal fighting the wind. So, hair jigging it. The hair jigging in 30 mile an hour winds is not exactly the most fun thing. Those brown bass like that wind. And when they like that wind, they like the jerk bait to go with the wind. <laughs> Good combo. Mm. Love it, love it, love it, love it. You know, I was thinking of the old days on a spot like this. You got a 30 mile an hour wind blowing. 30 miles an hour, and I can pull on these spots with my old trucks and spot lock on that Minn Kota, pin down on this spot and never touch that troll again. And fake big current winds like this, it is one of the biggest breakthroughs for me in helping me catch more fish than ever before was that old trucks and spot lock. Just an amazingly uh, productive piece of equipment.